I never felt like I've left the entertainment industry and moving to Web3. I feel like I'm one that is trying to redefine it. If I don't sit there and go, that's it, man. That is fucking it. It's not walking out the door. If you feel great and you think you've done everything you possibly can, then you leave it to the world to determine if it's gonna be successful or not. And that's what we're doing in Web3. We've been told from the movie studios to the Web3 industry itself that there is no company in the world like Orange Comet now. We're looking to be a multi-billion dollar publicly traded company. Period, end of story. I haven't seen anybody coming through Web3 the way you guys do it. We got involved in an amazing project with a British boy. His name is Joe Whale. I think I have the opportunity with Joe to make the next Pixar type movie. And all off of the mind and the work of a wonderful 13 year old artist. How do you find the bandwidth to do all these damn projects? If I sit out to do something, I get it done. And I'm not gonna fail here. There's no fucking way I'm gonna fail. I don't feel like I've reached my potential. And that's what's driving me. Tell kids and even grad students, they've gotta find something that they believe in, first and foremost. You know, people say, ah, passion's bullshit. No, it's not. It's not. It drives everything. It just does, man. Once you make that decision to do something and pursue something, and you gotta go or you gotta get out. You don't know what tomorrow holds. Don't you wanna try and live out your potential, find the happiness? You need to find inside of each of us what ultimately is gonna make us happy and try and pursue that.